Alright, this is maybe some kind of hospital? And as we know, hospitals are never scary places. Never scary. Oh, a spooky. Wow. I see. All right. Hmm. I think I saw a vent up there, but we'll see how far right we can go. This is a game that tends to be very linear in that it's usually you're going left or right or forward and back. Alright. Back to that possible gate. Unless we can go in this direction, maybe? There's already a light in there. Hey, I need a cola! Here you go, friend. Have a soda. It's on me. I got my own. There we go. Someone prepaid for us. How nice. Hiya! Oh. Another TV moment. Come on, straight now. Now we've entered the Twilight Zone. Now the question is, are are we like trying to find Is our friend interrupting us? I struggle to know if it's a good thing or a bad thing when we have these TV moments. It certainly seems like we're trying to get to that door and see what happens. I wonder what's going to happen on the other side of that door. Alright, I know it's looking up. Uh, we need two power cores, I see. This is going to be a big exploration level. Key inside of a teddy bear. Okay. Alright, you do have a skeleton inside you, unfortunately. Um, I'm afraid we can't remove it. Oh no! There's a skeleton inside me too! Oh no! No, 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 no! We've gotta find a cure. The cure for these bones! Yeah, the environmental storytelling is pretty nice. Alright, it's nice that you're picking up things, but we need teddy bears, because one of them has a key. We need that key to get a power core. And we use that power core to pull a lever to take us to the next area to get another key to get another power core. Pull a lever to go to the next area. 
etc., etc., et al. Figure I'll put like all three toys in there and then we can just grab the one that has the uh e easy. Easy. We do keep seeing that eye everywhere. I remember in the first game the eyes like turned us into stone. Aha. Oh. Is there like a megaphone inside that one? Dang it. Hold on, I think that's the one that has the key. Yes, it is. Oh, there's like an axe head inside of her toy. Alright, so we got this. Um... But how do I open it, is the question. Oh... Do we need to open that? Hmm... If that has an axe head, I assume that's a sharp thing we can use to open. But I can't, like... Combine. At. What? I don't see a hat. Unless it's up there. I can't seem to climb up there. Oh, maybe I can climb up here. Is that a teddy bear hat? Alright, we've had the raccoon hat for a while. We can switch to the sad teddy bear. Oh, for a second there, I was worried I was about to break my ankles. Alright. I know you're carrying that toy. But what are we going to do with it? Yes, there's an axe inside of it, but... Apparently, we can't open it. Do we need, like, a smaller axe? Or a screw... No, maybe we need a screwdriver. Hmm. Usually, we don't have to go far to solve puzzles. Even though this is an expansive room. So, I am missing something. What do you want me to do? Okay, I know you're showing me that it has an axe inside of it, but how do we how do we open it? All right, maybe we do need to go to a different area. Maybe there's something that can tear or crush. Ah, this is the Maurg. Maybe we can put the bear in there, actually. We can try burning it. He should be fine. Incinerate the bear. Cast it into the depths of the burning inferno. Did that bear just sit up back there? I'm gonna I'm gonna pretend that's nothing. Yep. That is not my problem. No siree. That is just physics doing physics things.
There we go. No, don't climb in yourself. All right, now you can climb in. All right, I have the key. Um, hold on, where's the thing she threw in? I thought there was like a, an axe head inside of it. Okay, I guess she just wanted to have it burned. She got her first taste of murder. I forgot I had some root beer here. I need to finish drinking that. Loves me some root beer. Yum, yum, yum. All right, we got a key. So now, let's see if we can get those power cores. Ah, uh, yes, the limb room. They're all artificial, though. They're like dolls. That music, no. That music, though. Is that a power core over there? Nope, that's a flush bit. All right, we can put that back down and move away. No, 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 We do not need crawling hands creeping everywhere. Oh, this is just a push out. Overthinking this. Where is a pipe? Fuck off! Fuck off! No! No, 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 no! No, 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 no! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Go away! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off. No, I can climb! Oh, no, 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 no! Run, run, run. Fuck! <laughs> oh, I hate this. I hate this. Oh, the way it clitter clatters. All right, we gotta bait it away, and I gotta grab a weapon. I got face. I got face grabbed. It's like a face hugger, but with one hand. Heh. Heh. Oh come on! It literally pathed the way I was trying to run, killing me, literally. A snake spear hands, because we don't have any. Exactly. Hands are an unnatural limb, okay? People need to embrace the superior worm form. Why can't I pick anything up? How do I kill it? Is 
Does it fear light? Nope. Alright, do I just have to outrace it maybe? I guess I do. Fuck you, hand. Oh, man. Are we gonna get chased by all sorts of limbs in this area? Oh, the hand's in the fence! It's not good. Ah! Fuck! Shit! I ain't gonna... Uh, that's a very cozy blanket! Fuck! Run, 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 run! It's a very nice and toasty blankie. Perfect for a terrified snake. Ah, power core! <gasps> Weapon! Oh, shit! It can dodge! It has multiple hit points. It's a boss battle. No! Okay, it can dodge. I have to wait for it to do its little its little tippy taps right before it does the uh, jump. you hand gotcha <laughs> let me crack those knuckles return without your PC bloken up that is always good Let's, uh, double tap. Just gotta, just gotta make sure. You never know. Yeah. Hands are feisty things. Alright, we got the power core. Alright, are we gonna, are we gonna deal with, like, a stomping foot next? Uh... Take that! Certainly a way to get the power core through. Alright, where the f are we? Ah, another like walking on broken glass, am I right? Friend, please be careful with hands, alright? Oh, oh, you're breaking it. All right, good job. That's a very good plan. We cannot trust the hands. All right, we got one system powered up. Now to find power core number two. Two. We use power core number one to get power core number two. That's certainly one way to gate areas. Not what I meant to do. I get further away from the wall. I hope you were having a... Good evening, Kona Bird. Uh, 
I guess I'm getting my Halloween started early with uh, doing all the horror games on Fridays. <laughs> Wait, we need another power core for that? What is going on here? Give me a boost! A trick or treat? Ah, uh, not really. Is that a person over there? I don't think so. I think it's just a doll. It moved! It moves in the darkness. Hey, I hate this. I hate this. Uh, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I need him out of the doorway, though. It gently holds you like a precious pinata. Use R to aim the flashlight. I see. Let me buy. Ah, he's not far enough away. It's funny because it's usually the monsters are attracted to the light, but in this game, a little bit of a light. Alright. That one gonna animate? That one gonna animate? Oh, the freaking skittering doll. Yeah, right? We'll leave it alone for two seconds, they start skittering. One of you's gonna try and kill me. One of you needs a bright light on them. Is it gonna be you? Is it gonna be me? Are we going to find out? Or will you leave me be? Hey! Hey! Multiple! Multiple tangos! I'm a little stuck here Spinning in circles with my single flashlight Trying to escape from this terrible love place. Uh, steal Jackie's feathers for us. No, don't steal my feathers. Don't pluck them. And uh, I can just, just, I'll just, I'll just keep the ones that as they fall off. You know, it's not like I use them when they're done. I need all of you to not. No. 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 Oh. <laughs> Scuffed memento. Oh. Yeah, I need to hold on. Let me get in the bright light. Hey, let me take a sip of root beer, because that's a... That's a certified root beer moment. I don't know what's worse. The ones that have, like, no head, the ones that have, like, the bandaged head, or these... These ones, where they just have, like, a tendril and then, like, a mouth on a faceplate. 
single-handedly gonna free the apocalypse of dolls upon the- No, 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 we're burning this place down. Uh, this place will not survive. It is not a survivor. It will be destroyed. Cast down into the abyss. Never to be perceived again. Alright, that's not the right way. Oh, vent. Duh. I didn't see that. My home. Oh, I thought you were a, an abyssal sea bunny. All right. Not there. They stay locked up. They stay locked up. No! Okay. Okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm perfectly fine. This is fine. They all want a piece of this worm, and who can blame them? They're all trying to boop the snoot. We gotta, we gotta get on past. Just, just keep running. Just keep running. Fuck, gang. I mean, it's a, it's a fucking uh, dual shock stick. So I, I. Slipped and pointed it in the wrong direction. Oh, you're taking your flashlight out, bud. Hey, hey, watch where you're grabbing there, buddy. Don't like that. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Aha, they can't climb. Suckers. Fuck. Oh, the leather croc. Ah, we're in the showers, I see. Just uh, use some soap. Hey-ya! Actually, hold on. Is that something in the background? What's this? Is this going to be a spooky little vision? I think it is. I hear bees or flies. Hmm. It's a rubber room. But there are no rats, so I guess I'm not crazy. Oh. All right. I imagine that's going to be like how the porcelain dolls were in the first game, where it was no actual effect. It was just a uh, kind of a an achievement. Collect all the things. Invisible rats. No, not invisible rats. They'll make me in invisibly crazy? Hmm. I see. That's not it. Rest for the wheels. 
Come on, they don't spin on trees. Hmm, I feel like the solution is not grabbing that. That could be an option. But then it's like, how do I... I knew it was gonna happen. I knew it was gonna happen and it still fucking got me. Oh God. Fuck off. I hate this, I hate this. Hey, did you know? I hate this. I hate this. Intentionally inflicts themselves upon horror games. <laughs> there we go. Have they even sit it down? Carefully. I love my scream. Thanks! I'm glad you found cathartic joy in my suffering. Alright, we'll get them all to come down bottom, and then we can do some rotations. Easy peasy. I missed one. No. Nope. I cornered myself. I'm cornering myself. I'm cornering myself. I'm cornering myself. No. 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 Stay back! I got a flashlight! Ooh, baby! Alright. Uh, just be friends with these guys. Uh, they want to be too friendly. Alright. I need that power core. But I'm not strong enough to push this. Get in the electric chair? I feel like that's how you die. So I think we have to pull the lever. There we go. As I thought, it was going to shoot out. Wear the helmet. Uh, that is a helmet you wear once. Because if you wear that helmet multiple times, um, you poor bastard. Alright. Friend, you do not want to know the horrors I have witnessed. Electric chair is how you get superpowers. You saw it in a movie. I don't believe you. <laughs> um... We need this power core now. Or is she gonna grab that one? All right. You grab that power core. I grab this one. Let's get the fuck out of here, friend. You don't believe you saw in a movie? Most believable thing you said all night. <laughs> I don't know, I feel like stealing my feathers for a nest is very believable. They are a vibrant, luxurious batch of feathers. I imagine they're the envy of many persons.
Oh, I guess we're going down. Well, friend, where are we headed? I can have them also floof. Whee! Fuck. 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 The nightmare code prevents me from declining a screaming challenge. What? are your terms? What's your spoo? <laughs> now, those snags will be a good snack, but I'm afraid these entities cannot be distracted with them. Not unless the snags glow in the dark. But if your eggs glow in the dark, Probably radiation. <laughs> oh, combat! little hand Oh fuck there's more of them Double tap Ooh we almost got it Use your mirror strike Use your limit break Always double tap. Alright, I'm glad I didn't have to defend friend. Wow! Pipe! So cool! <laughs> um... What? What's with the face? Are we about to meet Frankenstein's monster? Hmm. I think we found the doctor. Oh! Why is he crawling on the ceiling? Why? He's also, I think, missing a lower jaw. It's hard to tell how I can hide from him, considering he's on the ceiling. No, 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 We made it. We're good. Fine. This is fine. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I am fucked. Okay, we need something to call the elevator. And I see a bunch of throwable objects in the background. Thankfully, we got a checkpoint. So I like that for us. Do a barrel roll.
We gotta spin dash our way out of this. All right, we got our object. We just need to get back to the elevator. Yeah, we should have just ran straight into it. I don't know why. He's like some kind of grub. I like how friend is just not perceived. She just like, hold on. Let me let me just crawl under here real quick. Don't mind me. Now we have uppies. And sides. And then uppies once again. What a heavily undesirable sound to hear. <laughs> We're talking about the sound design in this game is fantastic. Oh, the spooky music. This is a wide open expanse of ceiling tiles. Do not like the potential. Okay. Did not break my ankles. All right, we're doing good. No, we need a key! Damn door. Um, see, this leads to another room. Can't open it. I don't think we made enough noise. Just go ahead and push me on through, please. Thank you. Yeah, if you don't think wet, labored mouth breathing is anything, uh, what, what are you talking about? I'm sure it is just peak ASMR. <laughs> ah, there's our key. Okay. I think we need to pull this out. a bit of a jumping puzzle. Little Nightmares 2, but we play as the friend and we wait for the main character. <laughs> like, man, what is he doing? Do, 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 do. I mean, I, I suppose, you know, maybe that she's spending all her time using her, her psychic power. If this is a sequel. This is a prequel, then I don't know. All right, that wasn't too bad of a key. All right, friend, pull me back. Oh, 
Huzzah! Let's bust out of this joint. Alright, we hit school, we hit hospital. I feel like we're gonna go into like a government building or a police station next. Or fire fight. Ooh, a firefighting place might be interesting. It seems like we're going through various public institutions. I still am not too sure as to some of the themes it's running with. The first one I felt was very much more straightforward, but also I feel like this one is a bit longer. Like, we're what? Been going for about three hours now? I feel like I'm only a third of the way through the game, whereas with Little Nightmares 1, that was more like one half to two thirds of the way through the game. I think it only took us five or six hours to beat um, Nightmares 1. This feels like there's a lot more still to get through. It's just clawing the wall. Very normal, insane behavior. Well, I mean, at least he washes his hands. You know, he is a doctor. You know, make sure, make sure to stay sanitary. Okay, we need to get that power core. Actually, can I have our friend boost us up? What do we got over here? Well, they're alive. Interesting. I oh, shine a light on him. Nothing. Hmm, that is like the one patient. Kind of what happened, I kind of want to see what happens if I drop on them. myself in a poor situation. Alright, I can still walk out. He's coding, Doc! Alright, so I think he's going to be stuck there while we do our thing over here. Damn, we just we just killed a person. But then again, we haven't really found any uh, normal people in here, so it remains to be seen if that was even a a, a person or if it was one of his mad experiments. Either way, get the fuck out of here. Oh, the escape sequence! Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! We gotta go! 
damn, friend is fast. She ain't even on screen. How did he catch me? Oh, interesting. The guy is no longer coding. By reloading last save, the other person is now, uh, just fine. To be fair, in the first game, she is, like, starving for most of it. How? Am I supposed to slide down the stairs, maybe? It's the only thing I can think of. Like, I'm holding run the whole time. Okay, we're actively getting slower. Fantastic. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Shit! Shit! What are we missing? Hmm. I don't see any side paths either. Frame-perfect grab. <laughs> yeah, I think that's what we need. I think we need infusion of the gnome power. The gnomes will bring it- It caught me on screen, transition! Are you bloody kidding me? What the blimey fuck is this shite? More gnomes! More gnomes! <laughs> Alright. 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 Okay, dude. Oh, I'm gonna die. I just sand to get clipped. Chum. Yeah. He doesn't. He doesn't be clapping me. Shit! 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 You stand Devastan, but then uh, you got yeeted, my friend. All right, we made it to the next part. Come on, come on, come on, come on.
Ah, yes. Follow me into the, uh... Crematorium, my friend. Oh ho ho ho! Oh ho ho ho! Toasty! <laughs> she fucking sits down to warm her hands. Oh man! The friend is merciless. Didn't have to burn him? Uh, I'm pretty sure I did, yeah, actually. Hey, it lets me walk into the fire. <sighs> All right, I would have been really annoyed if it did set me back to the very beginning of the sequence. No, literally, it is a choice. Huh. I kind of thought he would break out or he would just push his way out if uh, we didn't burn him. Well, I'm sure that has no possible consequence. Alright, that's the obvious way to go. What do we got in the foreground? Nothing. Alright. I think it's another TV sequence. No. It's just the rain. Never mind. I thought I heard, like, static from the TV. Oh my god, shoe. What is with this place in making shoes? We should eschew any other clothing option. Um, what the fuck are those? Is it wh what? 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 What were those falling? Oh, I think it's a TV. A body without a face. Um, we have to go that way. All right. Cool. 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 Sure love bodies without faces. And it smashed into a TV. Interesting. Why is it attracted to the TV? Hmm. The intrigue grows deeper. wants to get into that TV, it looks like. All 
Alright, so they're stuck staring at the TVs, but they're not smashing them like that other guy did. I feel like if we get too close, it's gonna mulch us. I mean, I don't know. I, I gotta at least try and see what happens if we can touch the TV. That was that was not what I expected. Uh, not at all. Um, let's watch out for the people that can just side beam us, I guess. They'll get in the way of uh, their TV. You know, having your TV on the bathtub is not a good idea, my friend. Ah, I gotta see if I can push it in. Wait, what? Oh, okay. I was like, wait, did our friend get left behind? Shit, shit, shit! Okay. Second there, I thought I wasn't gonna make it. Are you kidding me? Lame. I tried to jump to that other platform. I feel like that's what I have to do, actually. Can I just... Plop. Save 0.3 seconds! Alright, I wanna get- I need to get on that right side, because I see that gap I need to climb through, because we can't... exit. If I hit that... foreground. Nothing. Hmm. It seems like... Come on, you can make that jump like I did. Alright, we gotta find that key. Hey, we found that key. Is there anything else over here? That's kind of a small puzzle. Hmm. I see. All right. Okay, then. All right, comrade. Um, now we need to go up somehow? Um, I am confused. We need to do something with the elevator. Oh, I think I know what I need to do. Knock it down. Get over here again. Are you fucking with me, mate?
I think we need to be on top of the elevator, then call it up to get to the other area. That's kind of annoying that we have to redo this bob a thing jing a thing Maybe if I pay attention on the cutout zoom out. Oh, it's not doing it again. Never mind. No! I broke my ankles again. Oh, come on, bud. Now that's a jump. Third time is the charm, is what I would like for it to be. Okay. I don't even know if that's right. What if we just walk over here? Is there something in the back here? Nope, she's definitely staying near the elevator. I would like to not die again. Hey, I made the grab this time. Just had to delay it a little bit. Yeah! All right. Oh my god! Shoe. Shoe. Pick up the shoe! Alright, I guess I can't pick up the shoe. Never mind. I was just gonna throw the shoe. Something back here? No. What is that? It certainly seems like a distinctive big building. Got a, got a little Eye of Sauron-ish action going on. Maybe a control tower for the TVs? Hmm. Here you go. All right.
Now for the long jump. Ah! Help me! All right. Now we work our way through these apartment complexes. I presume that tower in the background is our ultimate goal. Climbing on the pipes outside of a house is kind of scary. Certainly wouldn't do it these days. Way a lot more than when I did last time. Oh, that sounds precarious. is falling apart run friend usually it's me that's tripping and getting fucked up wait what no no Friend? Yes! You can't be dead. May have cost me my flashlight. But you're worth a flashlight. Hey, maybe we'll find a new one. They could also be freeing up that button to be used for some other item we find. The eyes, the man, the man with the eyes. Dude, welcome on by! I hope you had a good evening playing some more Star Sector, I see. Hope I don't need to be quiet. Uh, no. No, no, no. Not in this area, but we have certainly been quite spooked. Um, you don't know me? I am Drekki Ormer, Draconic Serpent, Flightless Dragon, or simply a worm on the internet. Today we are playing Little Nightmares 2. Uh, so if you've already played this game, please, please no spoilers, uh, even if I fuck up, I'll figure it out. I'm a good gamer. I swear. <laughs> I don't know how long you're playing Star Sector, but at the very least, you should take a moment to go leave a piss and take a water, because I will certainly be here still. Ah, uh, we're doing another TV segment, I see. Seven hours? Jeez. Yeah, dude. Get you, get you some of that noms. Get you that good, good. Seems like every successive TV takes a little bit longer to tune into. I don't know if that means because we're making progress and we're getting closer.
I feel like we're getting so close to the door. Oh shit. What's beyond the door? The man. Are we about to get one ringed? Oh, fuck! Oh, no, no! Oh, no! No, no, no! No, no, no! Ah, oh, shit! Oh, he's got that glitchy way of moving! Ah! Oh. Oh, no. oh. <laughs> oh, don't make me do it again. Oh, the fucking zip across the room just oh jeez. Got that force joke. <laughs> Do it again, but don't die. Gee, thanks, Durangar. What the fuck? It seems like I need to hide, but... Apparently, I'm not doing it right. Come on, come on. E sleep. Have a good EB sleepy. I'm fucked. Wait, that's what I did the first time. Wait, no, friend. No. And it left the echo. What the fuck? Hope you have a good eat iced and have a great weekend. Friend. Friend. No. Friend! Give friend back! What the fuck? Teleported through. Also, we went through a bunch of meat, and there was an eye, so that was a thing. <sighs> Fuck! How dare he take friend. What the fuck is that? I guess we do another TV teleport. Take me to friend! Hmm. So those after images are of people who got got by the a ma tall man in black.
Now we're digging with TVs? Question mark? Oh, it's so rainy. We don't even have a raincoat. Oh, I almost fell. That would have been awkward. That TV's not on, I guess. Ooh. We have a universal remote. We can turn them on. We can turn them off. Interesting. Annoying. Adam Sandler's Click 2. one way to do things, I guess. Let's see. Um, wait, how the fuck do I make this jump? Oh, I need to pull that gurney out. Needed to come down here anyway. Gotcha. Mr. Freeman, where are you going? Hey, Sodder. Thanks for lurking. I hope you have a fantastic day. Hmm. Stop focusing on the TV. Oh, it is a nail room. We finally made it to one. Come on, grab the clothes hanger, baby. Great escape! Okay, what happens if I turn their TV off? Yee. Oh, it wants its TV back. Interesting. Hey, Leone. How are you doing this fine, scary Friday? I hope you're having a great time. I sure am. <laughs> All right, now I need to turn it off and do a bit of a loop-de-loop. We made it through that puzzle. I see this click is going to be quite the trusty tool. Oh, 